What's going on? This is Danielle Cannon with another Hip Hop Wired exclusive. I'm here with Emily B. How are you today, Emily? I'm great. Good. Now, for everyone who doesn't know, how did you get involved with Love & Hip Hop? Um, Love & Hip Hop was brought to me by a friend of mine named Misa Hilton. She was originally on the cast of four. That was her, Olivia, um, Chrissy, and, and Misa. And she approached me about doing it. And she asked me to take a meeting with Mona Scott. And I look up to Misa because she's also a stylist. And of course, she was connected through hip hop through the father of her child. And she continued on. And she's been very successful. So I went in and I took the meeting. And now, now that you've done the show, what does Bad think about all this? Is he happy for you? Is he excited? No comment. <laughs> No comment. Okay. After doing, I know. It's uh, he's very private. So you know, going in, I didn't know that so much would be talked about about him. And you know, it's a reality show because so they want to pick you for drama, and you know, they try to pick me for everything they knew that was bothering me, and they got me. Okay. <laughs> All right. Now a lot of the girls on the show seem to have drama with Samaya Reese, but you're kind of like I the don't have drama you're the Samaya. neutral party, right? Me and Samaya, we don't have no problems. I think she's a hustler and she does what she has to do, and, and I respect her hustle, exactly. you know. And I don't have no problems with her. Exactly. Now after doing the show, would you ever do reality shows again? Is it something you want to continue on in the future? Um, I don't know about that. <laughs> I would probably do a season two just so everybody could see where I'm at now. I'm not in the same space that I was in originally when I started shooting. So I would definitely do a season two just so you can see my growth. Now, what is one thing you want to say to people who are kind of like judging you and saying, oh, she kind of plays the background of Fab. What is something you want them to know about you? Because now that you are in the spotlight, you can really speak up for yourself. Well, I haven't really played the background. I've been there for him through it for his career. I felt like I helped him. And, you know, he's a trendsetter. He's one of the most stylish men in hip hop. And I feel like I was a part of that. And I enjoyed being that for him. And, you know, I, I got, I took pride in that, you know, so if I had to play the background and to help him where he's at, then I was fine with that, you know. And I didn't need to be in the spotlight because he's the star, not me. Okay. Now can we get just like one last shout out to say this is Emily B. You're checking out hiphopwire.com. Okay. This is Emily B. And you're checking out hiphopwire.com. Thank you. Thank you so much.